miracle maker, one with the great I am. I'm a metanoia, miracle maker, with God everything I can. Move mountains before me, God said trust in me. Hey everybody, praise the Lord, praise the Lord, praise the Lord everyone. This is Minister Tish coming to you live from my rehab in Orlando, Florida. First I want to give God the praise and honor for all that he has done and all that he is doing. Amen. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah Jesus. I have come to the end of this journey and I can move on it's so natural God you belong to me I belong to you hallelujah my name is Minister Tish I am from the Virgin Islands but doing this thing from Orlando, Florida. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I am blessed with five beautiful children. Jamie, Dimitri, Janelle, Salo, and Terrell. That's five beautiful children. So, I am to the end of this journey of this part one or part two journey of my revision. And my revision about six weeks ago on July 20th I had to go in and have my knee revision done because I had an infection and for the last six weeks I have been here in this rehab at Solaris which has been phenomenal for me I I didn't even know how I was gonna make it y'all but to God be the glory okay right now I'm finishing up where is my thing at hold on where is it is it yep here I got a new this is not a pick line I had a pick line earlier this is a med line my pick line this is where my medicine is being distributed into my veins into my blood so the infection can go here that is my one of my medication that I'm taking now and it's going to run for an hour praise God praise God praise God cuz I am down cuz I am out of here on a Wednesday September the 1st okay oh it has been a wonderful experience um, I thank my family, my children, my Facebook friends, and everybody that has prayed for me, that has visited me, called me, texted me, encouraged me. Um, I can't say enough. I wouldn't have gotten through it by the grace of God and y'all. So I appreciate y'all very, very much. However, my journey isn't over. Um, this part of this journey is over because I won't be taking any infusions anymore. Um, it was a round-the-clock situation. I had two medications that I was taking, one called Sepatine and the other called, I don't even know how to say it, but I just call it VAC. So the Sepatine I take twice, four times a day really, five in the morning, 11 in the afternoon, five at night, 11 at night been taking those for the last 36 days 1.5 milligram and the VAC I had started at 250 then I went up to 5 milligrams which I take that three times a day which was 6 a.m. 2 p.m. and 10 at night and every third day I had to get my blood work done because they had to monitor my blood work and my blood work wasn't in between the ranges of 10 to 20 then I was in trouble they would increase or decrease so I think the third week God has really been blessing me where I've hit like 12.5 15 
20 but just <laughs> I think it was yesterday I had yeah yesterday I was like 32.5 so there was like no no more of that you're not getting it in until as a matter of fact I got it this morning so now I'm at one a day because I leave I'm being discharged on Wednesday so I don't have to do those three times a day Ooh, hallelujah let me get the praise on get the praise on get the praise on oh Jesus oh but it is good um Solaris has taken very good care of me I um they spoiled me as well I thank God for the nurses I thank God for the CNNs I thank God for the dairy session um all of it has been instrumental in me recovering um, you know, they know me. I've been here before. This is my third time here, so I'm not like um, a stranger, but it's new because I had a spacer in my knee, so um, <laughs> couldn't I can't really like walk. I have to be in my wheelchair and do my exercise. Um, I still have another surgery to do, but I still have to stay off my knee, off my leg can't put any weight on it whatsoever so I won't be able to do that until I know when my last surgery is going to be Yay! and then I'll be back here for two weeks and then I will go to outpatient surgery rehab and start all over in Jesus name for the final final long ordeal because I just made a year anniversary on 8 27th of i think it was saturday no sunday yeah saturday i made my year anniversary of having my total knee replacement now as i said before god works in mysterious ways everybody is not gonna go through what i went through some people are just gonna have that one operation and be gone and you know boo -zoo -zoo -zoo. But other people may have a longer process, like I did. So, you know, it's not how you begin, it's how you finish this race. And I'm finishing this race victorious because I am victorious, victorious. Got a chance to start again. No, the song is glorious, but I'm just saying victorious, okay? I know what it is, but, um, with that being said and done, I'm just going to end off in prayer. I just want to buy you and close your eyes. Father God, I just want to thank you for these long 36 days that you blessed me here. You humbled me. You broke me. You let me see things in a different perspective that I didn't do before. Ask your Lord to pray for my roommates and all the staff and everybody that's in here, that they be healed in Jesus' name. Ask you to pray for my godson who just started college today, Lord. Thomas, lead God and direct them in this new direction. Pray for my kids. Pray for my grandkids, Lord. Bless them. I know they're going to be excited to see me. Pray for all those that's in the hospital with COVID or Delta, Lord. Pray for them, Lord. Heal them in a special way. Pray for those that are less fortunate than how we are. But I ask you in the precious name of Jesus to watch over the people in Louisiana, Lord. Pray for them as, you know, they have hardship right now, Lord. Lead God and direct them. Give them strength and courage to know that they can survive this. In Jesus' precious name. Pray for my brother, my sister, my nieces. Pray for my nephew. He will be 15 years old. Go ahead. Trey, Trey. In Jesus' name, we give you glory and honor. For you are the reason for the season. Amen. So with that being said and done, this is Minister Tish signing off. Y'all met a your woman. Step out of the boat and see I'm a metanoia Miracle maker One with the great I am I'm a metanoia Miracle maker With God everything I can Leave in the past behind of me Today is the day for me The hem of his garment for me today I 
am happy and free. I'm a metanoia, miracle maker. Peace, love, and happiness. I'm a metanoia. You are metanoia, miracle maker, to make miracles happen every day. Bless.